Writing your thesis in Word is fun, especially when trying to arrange pictures. But if you want something a little more stable, try LaTeX. It's much easier and more reliable for large documents, especially if they contain pictures, math and tables. Here's how to install it and basic commands to get started. The most common free LaTeX software is MeekTex paired with TextMaker. You can find MeekTex at www.meektex.org. There are other softwares like Overleaf, but MeekTex is completely free. Go to the MeekTex website and download the software for Microsoft, Mac, or Linux. Once downloaded, run the .exe file and install it. You can really tell that it's freeware because of its funky retro graphics. Once it is installed, we are also going to download TextMaker and install it. Go to www.texm1math.net slash TextMaker and download the installation package for your operating system. TextMaker is called the front end and is what we are going to interact with while MicTex does the legwork at the back. Once you've downloaded the TextMaker file, install it. Now that both softwares have been installed, simply open the program called TextMaker and you will see this starting page. TextMaker is where we are going to write everything. Now on to the basic commands. First, click the new button to get a new sheet. LaTeX uses code to make your final document, which will be a PDF. You write control statements to perfectly format your document automatically. First, any line that starts with a backslash tells LaTeX that whatever follows is a command and not actual text you want to see in your PDF. For example, we start our document by writing, backslash document class curly bracket article and curly bracket. This tells LaTeX that our file is an article and to use its inbuilt formatting for articles. Then we write, backslash begin curly bracket document and curly bracket. This means we are going to start writing now. Now, we can write whatever we want. This will be compiled into the end PDF we will get. For example, let's write, Mary had a little lamb, little lamb, little lamb. This is what will be shown in our PDF. Finally, we need to tell LaTeX that this is the end of our document by writing, backslash and curly bracket document and curly bracket. Great, we have our LaTeX file, but now what? How do we get our PDF? That's where we now compile our document into a PDF by clicking the play button here. And magically, our PDF appears on the right side here. That is the basic document. Let's cover how to make sections and paragraphs because all dissertations have different sections and paragraphs. Coming back to our text document on the left. We are going to delete our Mary had a little lamb part and write, backslash section curly bracket, this is a new section, and curly bracket. Hit enter to create a new section. To make a new paragraph, just leave a line in the latex document. Leaving more than one line doesn't do anything to the PDF. Let's add some text in paragraphs. Now hit compile to see your PDF. Done. These are the basic commands and process to make your thesis in latex. In the next videos, we will cover more advanced features like adding math, tables, figures, page numbers, tables of contents, and more. Everything you need, to write your dissertation.